No problem. Didn't work. Didn't work. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Didn't work. Didn't work. <laughs> <laughs> intrude on our meditations you know the penalty for <gasps> Revan you are back Malak told us what happened to you the Jedi Council has stripped you of your power you are a shell of what you once were you are not fit to rule the Sith anymore Revan Darth Malak will reward us greatly for destroying you Malak told us you still lived. 
At last, a challenge worthy of my skills. I grow so bored with slaughtering these mindless training droids. I intensified my training tenfold in hopes I would get the chance to face you in mortal combat. I am glad to see my training has not been in vain. steps on this will get a nasty shock. What is it? Yes?
Yes? No problem. Didn't work. <laughs>
Yengil kung no ba, mole na chiko. Tong hai tung kong chin. Ne bobo je mata, ne pong nash. Dolpe ki kyuna. Rondi hao dong a ku hong kabi. Wala kung bes. Cheng pala muli tong king ba no kong kek. Tuk ning ta cho kong. Ne mole na bes. Tong hai wang chiki yuma li tak ak inko tu. Tok da bong walia gando de na aga cho cho. Ka chi cho ita au donga. Yo malita inko tu, je lo moran de ni bobo. Wango kun bis kangba, molera, ta kun jostak miki grab lo mogo. Kachicho ita haudanga, tompa de bong walia gando de nago chocho. Moga chaponka, bola wala chepne. Ba mulis limo por ala wanga kun bis molera best. Kachicho ita haudanga, yin kin kuno ba molera chikun. Slimo putona, ronde a... Tong hai wam chiki yuma litha ad inko tu. Tok da bong gwalia gando de naga cho cho. Ka chicho ita au donga. Yukta kong jostak miki grabl mogo. Ka chicho ita au donga. Tok da bong gwalia gando de nago cho. Rondi hao donga ku honga bi. Wala kung bes. Cheng pala muli. Jebe doana ni bobo. Tong na bong sha nong gyan. Tong pa toga smak telia. Ako che kopa. Jero. Tong hai wam chiki yuma litha ad inko tu. Tok da bong gwalia gando de naga cho cho. Ka chicho ita au donga. Ta kong jostak miki grab lo mogo. Ka chicho ita au donga. Tok da bong gwalia gando de nago cho cho. Moga sha ponka, bola wala chepne. Pa mulis di mo. Tong hai wam chiki yuma litha ad inko tu. Tok da bong gwalia gando de naga cho cho. Ka chicho ita au donga, ta kong jostak miki grab lo mogo. Ka chicho ita au donga, tompa de bong gwalia gando de nago cho cho. Mo tong hai wam chiki yuma litha ad inko tu. Tok da bong gwalia gando de naga cho cho. Ta kong jostak miki grab lo mogo. Ka chicho ita au donga.
Macron dijo don a Kuhon Kadi, Wala Kumbes, Cheng para Moli Tong King Ba No Kong King. Tukning Tacho Kung, Nemole da Best, Tong Hai Wam Chichi Yuma Lipta Ad Inko Tu. Toto da Bong Wali Agando de Nara Chocho, Kachicho Ita Ao Donga. Yuma Lita Inko Tu. Jelo Moran Beni Bobo. Wango Kumbis Kang Ba Molera, Takon Jostak Miki Grabber Mogo. Kachicho Ita Ao Donga. Tompa de bon guaya canto de nago chocho. Moga chaponca, bola wala chetne. Pamulis limo por ala wanga kun bis mula rabes. Tonghai wam chichi yuma lipta ad inko tu. Tolta da bon guaya canto de naga chocho. Kachicho ita au donga. Yuma lita inko tu. Jelo moran beni bobo. Wango kun bis kamba mula ra. Takon jostak miki grabber mogo. Kachicho ita au donga. Tolpa de bon guaya gando de nago chocho. Moga chaponka, bola wala chekne, kachicho ita hotonga. Yin kin kuno ba bulira chikun. Slimo putona, ronde hodon, ton hai wam chichi yuma lipta ad inko tu. Tolpa da bon guaya gando de naga chocho, kachicho ita hodonga. Yuma lita inko tu. Ta kun jostak miki grabber mo. Ta kun jostak miki grabber mo. Kachicho ita au donga. Tolpa de bon guaya gando de nago chocho. Moga chapon. Tong hai wam chichi yuma lipta ad inko tu. Tolpa de bon guaya gando de nago chocho. Kachicho ita apta kun jostak miki grabber mo. Kachicho ita au donga. Tolpa de bon guaya gando de nago chocho. Moga chapon ka. Bola wala chekne. Pamulis limo por ala wanga kun bis mula rabes. Ta kun jostak miki grabber mogo. Kachicho ita au donga. Tolpa de bon guaya gando de nago chocho. Moga chapon ka. Bola wala chekne. Pamulis limo por ala wanga kun bis mula rabes. Tong hai wam chichi yuma lipta ad inko tu. Tolpa de bon guaya gando de nago chocho. Kachicho ita au donga. Yuma lita inko tu. Jelo moran beni bobo. Wango kun bis kamba molera. Ta kun jostak miki grabber mogo. Kachicho ita au donga. Tolpa de bon guaya gando de nago chocho. Moga chapon ka. Tong hai wam chichi yuma lipta ad inko tu. Tolpa de bon guaya gando de nago chocho. Kachicho ita au donga. Yuma lita inko tu. Jelo mor. Ta kun jostak miki grabber mogo. Kachicho ita au donga. Tolpa. Tong hai wam chichi yuma lipta ad inko tu. Tolpa da bon guaya gando de nara chocho. Ta kun jostak miki grabber mogo. Kachicho ita au donga. Tolpa da bon guaya gando de nara. Rondi hao donga ku honga bi. Wala kumbes. Cheng para moli tong king ba no kong king. Tukning ta chokun. Ne mole da best. Ta kun jostak miki. Kachicho ita ho tonga. Yin ki kuno ba bulira chikun. Slimo putona. Uyita na tanya yeta. Wata yama ka wong.
Your wish? afraid to enter the temple again, but he doesn't know you like I do. Not anymore. Not since you've changed. Quickly! Bestilla, come with us. We have to escape before Malak arrives. Escape? You don't understand. I have sworn allegiance to Lord Malak and the Sith. I am no longer a pawn of the Jedi Council. Surely you know what I mean, Revan. Look at what the Council did to you. They turned you into their puppet. The same thing they do to all who are truly strong in the Force. They speak of the dark side as if it is something to be feared. But in reality, their only goal is to manipulate those who are strong in the Force. The fear of the dark side is a tool to maintain control. Why do you think the Jedi forbid you and Malak from joining the Mandalorian Wars? They knew you would realize your true potential and break free of their domination. Malak has shown me how the Jedi Council have been using me the same way they once tried to use you. They've been holding me back because they knew one day I would surpass them all. I resisted it first. I endured the Sith torments with the passionless serenity of a true Jedi, emptying my mind. But after a week of endless tortures, I finally saw the truth. Malak forced me to acknowledge my anger and pain. He showed me the liberating power of these emotions. Then he made me see how the Jedi Council has denied me what is mine by right. The Jedi Council gladly used my battle meditation in their wars, but they still treated me like a child, like an inferior. They were jealous of my power, of what I could become. They wanted me to bow and call them master and follow their code and obey their every order. But all the while, they were exploiting my battle meditation for their own use. Lies. You were the one living a lie, Revan. 
The Jedi Council made you into something you are not. They programmed you to be their slave. You used to be Revan, Master of the Sith, but no longer. You were simply a pawn of the Jedi Council and the Republic they serve, like I was, until Malak freed me from their shackles. A pity the power you once had is so diluted in you. You could have been as strong as I am now. Stronger even, but that will never happen now. With the power of the Starforge, Malak will destroy the Republic and conquer the galaxy. And I will be the apprentice at his side, after I prove my worth by killing you. You were stronger than I would have thought possible after what the Jedi Council did to you. Seems that Malik was wrong. The power of the dark side has not lost you after all, Revan. You can deny what you are, Revan, but you're only fooling yourself. I know the truth. I have seen the shadows inside your mind, remember? I was there when you nearly died in the trap set by the Jedi Council. I used the Force to preserve your life, Revan. We are forever linked by my actions on that bridge. These are not your true feelings, Revan. You are speaking as a tool of the Jedi Council, as I once did. But now I see how the Jedi used us both. The Council tried to exploit the bond between us. They hoped I would draw out your memories to lead them to the Star Forge. We were slaves to their will, like all who follow the Jedi Code. But in our shared visions of the star maps, I also felt the so-called taint within you. I resisted it at first, but now I embrace the power of the dark side. Your dark side. Mistakes. No, Revan. The only mistake you are making is the one you are making now. You deny yourself the power that is yours by right. Only now do I realize how strong you are. You deserve to be the true master of the Sith, not Malak. I see this now. Together we can destroy your old apprentice. Join with me and reclaim your lost identity. Your mind was too badly damaged to ever fully restore your memories, Revan. But your power, your strength of will, the essence of who and what you are, these things still remain. Once, long ago, you defied the Jedi Council, freeing yourself from their control. You claimed your rightful title of Dark Lord of the Sith. Together we can defeat Malak and take back what is yours. Bessila, it is not too late for you to be saved. The teachings of the Jedi can lead you from the dark side back into the light and the true understanding of the Force. You are beneath my contempt, Juhani. When you felt the power of the dark side, you fled to a cave like some cowering animal. You know nothing of the Force or its true potential. But you, Revan, the power of the dark side is yours to command. You can use it to destroy Malak. With my help, you could rule over the entire galaxy. You were a pathetic fool, Revan. Together we could have defeated Malak and ruled over an empire. But now, I will be at Lord Malak's side instead. You will be crushed with the Republic and all the fools who bow down to the Jedi Council. No one can stand against the power of the Star Forge and the Sith Fleet.
Cheng para muli tong king pa tong abut sa kundeno. Wanga kumbi. Tago just tak mik grabul mo. Kajicho ita ao donga. Tolpa do pong wanya gando de na tong hai wam chiti yuman lipsa ang inkutu. Tolpa da pong wanya gando de na aga chucho. Kajicho ita ho donga. Yin ki kuno ba muli ra chikun. Slimo Botona, Ronde Aldonga Kuongabi. Ita Haldonga. 
Don't put the book, don't hang on to the human lips that are in book two. Talk about what you're going to do in our chucho. Cachicho, that's on your stack, make a grab a mobile. Cachicho, eat a hot dog. Don't put the book, what you're going to do in our chucho. Moga shaponka, bola wala chekne. Don't hang on to the human lips that are in book two. Talk about what you're going to do. ダゴンジョスタクトンハイダゴンジョスタクトンハイダゴンジョスタクトンハイダゴンジョスタクミキガブモゴガチチョギタハウドンガトトンハイワンチジユマリサアインコトトトダゴンワリアガンドデナーチ
What? Where's Bastila? Is she alive? What happened inside that temple? The dark side? Bastila? No! No! How could that happen? She was always in danger of being seduced by the dark side, Karth. Bastila was strong, but she was always impatient and headstrong. Malak preyed upon her weakness. This planet is a tainted place. Starforge and the Temple have twisted the Force into an instrument of evil, just as Malak has twisted Bastila into a servant of the Sith. Malak has a strong hold on Bastila now. It will be difficult for her to break free of his influence, especially considering her long association with you. Remember the bond that was forged between you when she rekindled the spark that was your life. Through that bond, she touched your memories, and also the echo of the dark taint within you. But there's still hope for her, right? I mean, Revan rejected the dark side, so Basila could too, right? We still might be able to save her. I don't know what the fate awaits us, but I sense Bastila still has a role to play in the events to come. I have no doubt she will be waiting for us on the Star Forge. No doubt. But let's go then before she has time to organize a bigger welcoming committee. What's on your mind? You got it. Got something on... Oh, I... How may I be... What is it you... Of course. The fleet must have gotten the message I sent as we were crashing into that planet. I'm picking up the transmission from them now. This is Admiral Fawn Dodonna to the Avon Hawk. Do you read us? Admiral Dodonna, this is Karth Anassi. We're receiving your transmission. Karth, I'm glad to see you're still alive. We've begun our assault on the Star Forge, but we're taking heavy losses. How did the Sith ever manage to build something of this scope? The Star Forge wasn't constructed by the Sith, Admiral. We don't have time for me to fully explain it. But that space station is far older than you can imagine. Maybe we should pull the fleet back and retreat. I don't know if we have the firepower to go up against this alien technology. You can't do that, Admiral. The Star Forge is a factory of immense power. It's been churning out the capital ships, snub fighters, and assault droids that have powered the Sith war effort. 
You have to destroy the Starforge now, or you'll be fighting an unending wave of reinforcements. Then I guess we have no choice. But it isn't going to be easy. I can't even get our capital ships into position to start bombarding the Starforge. The Sith fleet is too well organized. It's like they can guess our every move and count our every strategy. It's because of Bastila, Admiral. She turned to the dark side and became Malak's apprentice. We suspect she's somewhere on that space station right now, using her battle meditation against you and your fleet. This is Master Vandor. A number of Jedi Knights have joined our fleet under his command. If Bastila is using her power to augment the Sith, then Malak's fleet is invincible. Our only hope is to somehow stop Bastila from using her battle meditation. How can we do that if she's on the space station? I will send a squadron of Jedi Knights to the Starforge to find Bastila. Their small ships will be able to fly through the Sith blockade and dock on the space station. If they can find Bastila, they may be able to distract her attention from the battle overhead. That should allow you to move your capital ships into position for a final assault on the Starforge itself. I hate to ask this after all you've done, Karth, but the Jedi may need all the help they can get. Don't worry, Admiral. The Evanhawk and her crew are gonna see this through to the end. And may the Force be with you. Yes, what's on your mind? You got it. made it. Several Jedi have already gone ahead into the Starforge. We have to strike while we still have the element of surprise. If we don't stop Bastila from using her battle meditation, the entire Republic fleet will be wiped out. Come on, before they... Damn! So much for catching them unprepared. We'll deal with these Sith. You get into the Starforge and find Bastila. Hurry! <laughs>
We don't want the Sith to cut off our escape. The Sith will want to cut off our escape. We'll stay here and protect the ship so we can get out of here once you stop Bastler. Jedi have penetrated our defenses. Their fighters have landed on the Starforge. This is not unexpected. The Jedi are formidable opponents. Send the Starforge's battle droids to deal with them. Lord Malak, forgive me, but how can mere droids be a match for the Jedi? You underestimate the power of the Starforge's droid army. Dispatch the droids. Of course, Lord Malak. The Jedi have invaded the Starforge. Destroy them. Destroy them all.
Stop them. Strange. I did not think there were any among the Order who could survive an attack by an army of the Starforge's battle droids. It, it was Revan, Lord Malak. Your old master is with the Jedi here on the Starforge. Yes. That would explain why the droids failed. Revan was always strong in the Force. Very well. Send out all available troops, the apprentices as well. Think they could stop Revan, Lord Malak? Of course not. But they will slow Revan down. That will give me the time I need to fully prepare the Star Forge's defenses. I am curious to see the true extent of this space station's capabilities. One as powerful as my old master will make an interesting test subject.
Public capital ships could break through and attack the Starforge itself. This will not take long, Bastula. You will be able to resume your battle meditation soon enough. I only wanted you to know that Revan is here on the Starforge. Revan? But. The force is bringing us towards a confrontation with my old master. The Starforge has drawn our enemies together, so they may all die in a single. Glorious day. You must kill Revan to prove yourself worthy of being my apprentice, Bastila. You must finish what began in the Rakatan Temple. Yes, Lord Malak. I sense your fear, Bastila, but it is unfounded. The power of the Starforge will feed the dark side within you. It will give you the strength you need to defeat my old master. Stay here in the command center while you use your battle meditation against the Republic fleet. Revan will find you here in due time. It is inevitable. Of course, Master. I will not fail you again. of the station's defenses. And then we shall see if Revan can stand against the full fury of the Starforge. <laughs> Thank you. 
You will fall! Your wish? What? 